and we ain't gonna put up with it no more. You're absolutely right, Clyde. And I am going to do something about it. Since Herb and me here constitute a quorum of the Board of Selectmen, I hereby call a special meeting right now. Whereas Tobias Brown has offended the citizens of Delphi, I move that Clyde Hamilton be appointed as a committee of one to tell said Tobias Brown to mend his ways or, well, to mend his ways. I second the motion. No. All those in favor? Hey. I, I, the guys have it. No, hold your horses. I, I'm again that. Well, thank you, Clyde, but unfortunately, your opinion isn't worth anything here because you're not a selectman. Meeting adjourned. No. Adjourned. <clears throat> he'll kill me. He'll set his dogs on me. There ain't no telling what he'll do. I'm not going to do it. He might draw a knife on me. I'm surprised at you, Clyde. You don't want the whole town to know that you're afraid of Tobias Brown, do you? Oh, I'm not afraid of him. And anyway, how's the whole town to know, even if I was? You wouldn't want to read it in Doyle McGee's paper, would you? Listen, if Doyle McGee so much as one line, I'll... Glad you're here, Doyle. Herb and me just accepted Clyde's offer to put Tobias Brown in his place. As the other selectmen, you can make it unanimous. I didn't offer no such a thing, Doyle. I just said that they ought to... T -t 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 I say again. I, I didn't offer no such a thing, Doyle. I just said that they... I approve of that action, Finance. I think Clyde's offer should be publicized. Shows a fine civic spirit. But what's to be gained by getting Clyde all stove up by Tobias Brown? Oh, might be hard for you to bake with a lot of broken arms and legs. <laughs> <laughs> oh, y'all is just joking. Y'all are just a bunch of jokers. That was an easy one. It's the last time I'll come in this place. You'll have to make one more trip to pay for your coffee. <laughs> <laughs> Easy. Hey, Paul, Ma want you. Can I have a hamburger? No, you may not. Ah, oh, gee. Oh. I'm sorry, Finus. Ain't no matter, Willie. He does it all the time. Seems to me the whole town would be better off if you dusted him out once in a while. After all, you're his father and the principal of his school. What more excuse do you want? Yes, I, I really must do something about the boy. And I'd better see what his mother wants. Here, let me get this. Thank you. I'll pay for yours, too, Reverend. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Brother Davis. Thank you, Finus. Good day, Finus. Bye. Hi, Finus. Thank you. Hi, Finus. Thank you. Watch that door! 